Let's kick up this game. It's another best of three. The loser is eliminated from the qualifier. The winner faces Kevin and yet another best of three. And the winner from that is qualified for the main season. Dude, what a rise for Kevin that would be from ESL Meisterschaft relegation into the playoffs and into the top 16 of DreamHack. That would be quite something. That would be unheard of. Yeah, it would be pretty epic for him. His uh, journey <laughs> was a fun one to follow. And he's such a good guy. We met him the first time at Iron Couch back then, which feels like a million years ago. And uh, he's a really good dude, man. Always really fun to hang out with. Unfortunately, he is not coming to the Experion event because no. he's working. Honestly, <laughs> what a loser. Who's working, dude? I, just, I, I think he just doesn't want to uh, leave the Zaland. Now he lives somewhere else now. He told oh. us. Where did, where did he live? Würzburg or something? Not sure where exactly, but... Yeah, he left the incest province and now he will live somewhere else. Dude, careful. Late Master, of course, by Cooper. What else? Starting off with gloves. The other side, Robinson. With a normal build. I expected something else. I've seen wild things from him. But Keeper Craft it is. Now when it counts, now that his tournament life is on the line. But Whisk Scout over here sees Cooper's creeping. Oh, and the Keeper's coming in here. This is looking a little bit sketchy. Having the right early game as or can be pretty difficult. We've seen that plenty of times in VGL. Oh, and that grunt's dead. Oh, the block by Robinson. Can he get in an eye? Okay. Yep. Dude, the body blocks by Robinson are pretty swift, actually. I like that good opening. And here we have the expansion before the tech for Robinson. Okay. That's going to slow down tier two quite a bit. Oh my god, the oh, peon scout. Sick, Cooper. Right? It's a pretty high level play so far for a close qualifier lower bracket. But he doesn't have a staff. Gonna Wait a minute. We're going to buy it though. Let's do it. Exactly. He moves back to the shop. And that is a cancel. Only one entangle in Robinson. Maybe should have gone back to the main to get some more mana points. Because, Lasty. Uh, that's yeah. That's, that's not gonna be saved. Bye bye. He says to the trees, like Greta. What's her name again? Umberg? No. What's her name? Mhm. Mm no, it's not Umberg. Is Toon it? Toonberg. Toonberg. Okay, that's the one. Little autist girl trying to save the world. Very cute. Yeah, Mr. Rogan. Here we go, tier two instead. What do you mean? She's trying to save the world, isn't she? Sounds like you're trying to make fun of her. <laughs> We're not allowed to have fun. How dare you, Mr. Trump? How dare you? The backstab off. Hunter's not ready for any steals. And that puts Robinson in a pretty decent position. Shadowhunter is coming. Tech a whole lot ahead. He can play his tier 2 advantage then. How is that AP not triggering the creeps? What? Seen this? Nope. <laughs> Leather. That's a big sleep. <laughs> the red dot is covered by the orange creep circle. That's pretty crazy. Uh, friend of the trolls maybe bribed them before. I mean, they're both kind of forest creatures, I guess. Ooh, deny with a treat. Like the place. I think this is pretty passive here so far. Does not want to have his grunts murdered. A One went down already. Ooh, wakes up the creeps. Oh, can he take out the AP? Dude, does he not see it? It's nighttime. He should. But that Berserker is going to town now. Hunter's down as well. Alright, this is perhaps not exactly working out the way Robinson was hoping. AP is going to fall here now. And plan B again. 
with the expo. Hmm. Eh, that didn't exactly work out the way it was intended. Not really. It takes some time off of Cooper's clock, right? I mean, it's not giving him too much experience. Might be going for the lab next, but experience wise, I guess he can get the level 3 keeper here very soon. Gets it now. Expo coming up again, too. It did buy some time. Well, it did buy some time. Where is the Alchemist? Joining the party here very late. Having another round, this is you know? Maybe maybe it's happy hour at the CH Tavern. Yeah, it turns night time. Finally, the bouncer's gonna kick him out. All right, it's time to go back <laughs> home. How fitting, right? 6 a.m. Last call, Alchemist. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna... Let's go throw some bottles. Hey, if he was drinking all night, he's looking very healthy. I'm impressed. I could do that when I was 19 years old. Not anymore. Well, I guess... Dude, uh, do you remember when you were 19 years old? You would get super hammered, sleep for six hours, and then it would all be totally fine. And it would not be a problem at all. Well, for me that never happened because I'm always hungover. It doesn't matter if I'm 14 or 32. But Wait, uh, I... It, it didn't get worse? No, no, it's, it, it, it's, it started really, really, really bad and always stayed that level. Seriously? It, Your hangovers... I guess it did not get worse over the years. I think they got better, actually. What? <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess you started out being unlucky, but then kind of got lucky over the years in terms of hangover. I'm just living so that healthy is, at the moment. That is super weird, though. Like, you do realize that that's like, insanely rare. <laughs> oh, it's not the most important feature that you can get at age, I think. But it's a very valuable one. Are you kidding me? Mm, depends. Are you kidding me? Got a retrain to heal wave and hex. Okay. Early. Very early. The town is under siege. Can't so much damage. Fields the against archers, serpent water kind of bad. Which is kind of understandable. But you know, I saw Lin. Never retrains away from Serpent Wards Neo, so I wouldn't do it. Oh, of course. So far, so good. Cooper, though, a little late with the burrow. Has 650 gold floating. Goes in with the next uh, push, though. Keeper comes in as well. Oh boy, Lightning Shield. Can't save him, Candy. There's reveal. Little birdie kills of the blade. That's a big one. It could have been so good for Cooper. It might still be good because look at that tree of life. Oh, baby. What? What Trying tree of life? Lead his way to victory, but no. -uh. Um, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not seeing a tree of life. I can see the crumpled leftover pieces, the ruins. Because he did. Okay. I know he starts with the tier three, so he's on the pulse of time. We saw that before as well at WGL. If you lose the expo, go tier 3 and hope that that's going to work out. Okay, Arch is still pretty cheap. But Cooper also 30% done with that expo. Creeping up more. Should can, Could go to a shop, I guess. But Robinson, smelling this expo coming up. Gonna get that cancel here. Shouldn't be too many resources lost for Cooper if he cancels it quickly. Or he could... Buy some time here, let it take some damage to keep the red in the main time, but no. It's gonna do both things, cast it early and creep the red. A player's forces are under attack. Yeah, I think it's the right call. Plate Master's back as well. Close to three, gets the surround. For Kevin, that's pretty sweet, right? He can just sit there, backseat a little, watch Cooper play, take some notes and exploit them in their upcoming match. Clock of Flame, that's always a really cool item to have for the blade. We saw it before with Lightning Shield and Cloak. Hopefully this time though, it's gonna use Purge first to get out of the Entangle. That would be advisable. Also some Info Potions should be added at some point. Okay, on the other side, Belt of Giant Strength for the Alchemist. 
And Cooper's not trying to expand again, so we have a rare one base, one base, tier three, tier three, Night Elf Orc. Cooper goes for a torn totem here. Yeah. I want to give him a kiss. A big, <laughs> wet, smooch. Because oh, torrents would be pretty poggers. But I hope you don't do that. As it turns out. I hope you don't do that to me in Cologne. Gonna do that to everyone. I'm gonna be a big old slut. <laughs> <laughs> but that's nothing new. Twenty-four players gonna show up there. I think it's twenty-four players, right? That's the plan. Yeah. Maybe including you. Group stage. Yeah. Lewis Robinson only building his shop now. Wow. Finally time for staff and orb. Big master on the chase. Speed scroll pop. Shaman now getting into range. This could easily be a lot of archers going down. With some more purges. Smart TP by Robinson. So far. Robinson has a better shot than yesterday. Still playing a little bit from behind. Gets the bottom now. Everything up to the meta. Yesterday was indeed a, a little wild. His match versus Starbuck. Good Blade Master inventory still. Levels could be better, I guess, but nothing left to creep anymore. Just a little bit left in the upper left hand side, but not too easy. So, so far. Raiders and Bloodlust. Gonna be a nice upgrade there with that Bloodlust. Cooper could also go for a tiny. Once he feels confident enough here to expand again. Gonna creep the red camp first. Blade Master gonna get it closer to four. Not quite gonna get it though. But hoping for that big item. Scourge Bone Chimes with Bloodlust. <laughs> oh yeah, especially on this blade master. Chop, 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 chop. Full health. Really hard to knock him down. But also, not the greatest odds to get that desired item. Robinson is moving away from the upper left hand side, more to the middle. Maybe approaching the shop a little, waiting for the bottom, waiting for the next orb. Because he got number one now. No staff yet. And that does take some time with the healing. Ooh. A town is under siege. Pretty bad. I guess it's gonna be a sell. As the a sheep was burned by the cloak of flames. <laughs> Can be pretty tasty. Exactly. We love some lamb. At barbecue yesterday. Oh, really good. Yeah. Did you have lamb chops? Uh, no, just chicken. Bratwurst. <laughs> no, good just... Old, good old bratwurst. Just chicken. Chicken's also good. Invo potion on the blade, close to four. Telly staff not really necessary anymore, so we're moving around with the entire army. And Robinson is stubborn. He's not giving up on that tree idea. Attempt number three. Damn, I did it to myself again, Neil. Now I'm thinking about food. Did you get anything to eat in the break? Yeah, of course. Uh, got some bread. I, I was actually amazingly prepared. Got some carrots, got some peppers, got some, uh, well, what's the word? Vegan meatballs, but that sounds wrong. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Fake meatballs. I get it, though. Yeah, no, so I just actually didn't have anything to eat. I called my mom uh, in the break. <laughs> Can you bring me some food, mom? <laughs> I'm so hungry. It's only a two hour drive. Come on. Yeah, give me one of your most. <laughs> give, give me one of your famous chicken. Yep. And then I watched some Counter Strike. Oh, yeah, me too. On ESL. They have a best of five grand final. That's gonna go forever. Oh, yeah. If it's full distance. Today would be a great day to have full distance uh, finals, that's for sure. Alchemist not really in trouble as he is a super tanky boy. 1300 HP. Getting out the peons. Doesn't have the gold for a tiny though. But I guess he can just do a bit of long distance mining here. Cooper has enough lumber. It always amazes me how many games there are where the York is in the match like 12 minutes and suddenly no more lumber is required. <laughs> this game even went in tier 3. 
Yeah, but you know, tier 3 upgrades are really, really, really expensive for Orc. Don't think you're going for them. Oh, the third armor upgrade. What's it called again? The uh... Mithril? No, that's human. Uh, Terror... Arcanine? Or... No, Ar that's the Pokemon. Arcanite. Minute, what's it called? I think it's... Arcanite. Yeah, yeah, yeah Arcanite. Exactly. Let's go though, ra 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 everywhere, and it's oh my God, stormy. <laughs> oh, they're getting overrun. <laughs> it's the Orkish horde. <laughs> Not only a flood in southern Germany, also here on concealed yikers. And uh, it's a little magic trick. How fast can you make 1300 HP disappear? Didn't have the time there to pop the heal potion. Alchemist D E D dead. Oh, five shadow. Oh, this is a fun game, dude. Just Blade Master Bloodlust Perk. Yep. Just run, run, run. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. GG! That was a little brutal. In the end, Robinson holding his ground. Certainly, in my opinion, his best game of the qualifiers so far. He's competitive. If he's not losing that expansion early, who knows what happens. Closer than I thought. And take a good example of Remo. Remo is a fellow uh, Hydro homie of mine, so let's let's take a sip of water, everybody. Make sure that P is nice and bright, ladies and gentlemen. You should probably go to <laughs> bed. Don't forget to drink. What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm not tired at all. Zero percent. I woke up today at like 4.50 a.m., couldn't sleep anymore. <sighs> but if I had a dollar for every time you said that, then I played some ladder, then I tried to sleep again. Didn't play some ladder tonight. No, oh. Just uh, listen to some music and did some stuff. What kind of stuff? Um, <laughs> since you ask. <laughs> no. I am. Uh, I almost finished my uh, balance document. Oh, will you release it to the public? I'm not sure yet. The last time I did, it was like three weeks of people yelling at me. You're so stupid. That's such so many bad ideas. So um, maybe you should put experience. Maybe you should put it on Patreon. Um. Yeah, I could do that, but then it's going to get leaked, and it might be leading to the same thing. <laughs> ah, who would leak that? I mean, my my EPs and your uh, movie recommendations, they don't get leaked. The, the podcasts mm. aren't leaked. Yeah. That's a bit different, though. Patreon.com slash back to Warcraft, everybody. Remo promised it. He will uh, put it there in <laughs> probably, a, pro probably a week's time. Kevin already in chat in fear of Cooper. And map gonna be apparently not Amazonia. We did amazingly see it earlier today from Lynn, who almost had a really good early game there. Dude, I kept thinking about it. If he just commits with all the units for the Creepjack, how different would that game look? It's an answer that can never be a question that can never be answered, Neil. Why don't we have resume from replay? Blizzard, give us some functionality. You've been doing such a oh great job boy. at keeping this game up to date and having yeah, so many yeah, 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 wonderful yeah. features implemented. Okay, we're ready for map number two. It's going to be Autumn Leaves. Ready. Have fun. Uh, Terra's defeated Darkness, so he's facing the Great Wall next in the deciding round already. If you guys know any other results, <coughs> we're monitoring chat, that's for sure. Starbuck meeting either Biko or Hank, Dice meeting Paladin or Death Note, and of course our bracket has Kevin as the waiting opponent in the next round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Maybe you should have good ideas and you wouldn't be flamed by Ankis. <laughs> Like the, the comment by Ankis. It's good. Oh, we have a new game name. Not yet. In a bit. Ah, Ankis, I missed you, mate. Haven't seen him in a while. What's the game name? It's ASD? Yeah. 
No. It's supposed to be following a pattern. Now it's up. Was a little confused as well. Autumn leaves for our second map. This was the map that Lin vetoed earlier, who, which means he must be not fond of that map at all. But Cooper here is going to trust in his Blade Master once again. This was the map where Lin played the Farseer. And uh, Cooper has played Farseer on Terranus that before. I guess Nidal? Maybe this is going to be wild. Fun. Not against Nidal, though, right? Against Human, I would imagine. Cooper is definitely the orc in Europe that loves Blade the most. Who loves Blade more? Cooper or Hitman? It's a, it's a tough challenge. It's maybe a bit of a love triangle. How would we find out? Can we make like a contest? Hmm. How are we going to judge? They're both going to write a poetic, like a love poem or something? How do you prove your love the best? Isn't that... <laughs> An interesting question for life. Well, obviously with money. <laughs> <laughs> so, the player in the scene that has the most love in his heart is Ido? I guess so, yeah. Moon probably. I but yeah, so. uh, who spends the most money to build a Blade Master statue in his front yard? Wins the contest. Well, that man is still living at home, so if he was to put that in his parents' home, that would be kind of awkward, but... Why? Can be done. Don't you think his parents know what a Blade Master is? I mean, what else should they be talking about at the kitchen table? Yeah, I really wonder what they know about what their son's up to. I don't think it's much, honestly. <laughs> Which is a shame. Might be He's better. Really but okay, since you say it's not that awkward to put a statue in your parents' front yard... Mm -hmm. I, I guess that comes with some history, so what kind of statue did you, as a kid, or would you have put as a kid in your parents' front yard? Well, the local hero, Otto Valkes, of course. I would have thought you said, like, Power Rangers or something. Yeah. Is Otto Valkes <laughs> better than the Power Rangers? Dude, a Megazord, a Megazord would be Pog, too. But I think uh, my family could relate more to Otto Valkes and I'm... Um, a player's forces oh, are under attack. Would would be better for the family's sake. All right, I'm gonna test your auto like his knowledge right now. Guess how old he is right now. Oh, I think I looked that up not too long ago. Seventy-four. Not far off. Not far off. Seventy-two. Damn. Yeah, Damn he's man. aging slowly. I mean, he still looks the same, he kind still, of. He, well, he has hair glued to his base cap, so it doesn't appear that he's that bald. <laughs> bald. Wait, does he? Yeah, no. yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> it's That's kind, it's, so gross. It's kind of a joke, though. He says hello, and then the hair comes up with yeah, him. Yeah, I get that. I still think that's gross. <laughs> yeah. I guess a lot of stuff that you do is grosser than that. I don't glue my uh, hair to my cap. I don't have a cap, in fact. I do See. not own a base cap. Thank you, Stoker. Terra 1-0 up against uh, the Great Wall already, man. That is a speed run for Terra. Dude, Otto used to be young. Like, Otto <laughs> young <laughs> looks crazy. <laughs> oh my god. People have no I idea. I just remember him as an old guy. So, Clinton. Uh, Rick for Cooper so far, put some pressure, can't get level 2 here. Yay, yay, yay. But you do have Entangle, so... Paladin 2? Paladin 2 oh. Death Note already? Wow. What? We want to have all the Night Elves in the top 8, let's go. <laughs> go. Well, that, uh... Ban evasion on War 3 champions probably paying off. Another Ban AP. evasion? Yeah. 
What's that? He's evading his ban with Smurfs. Who? Paladin. Wait, what? Doesn't he stream under Paladin? Doesn't he play ladder all the time against Todd under Paladin? Well, he's, I, did, did, did you see that ladder game? Todd and Paladin? The no, other I just can't, I can't imagine. <laughs> it was just flaming for 15 minutes. Yeah, okay, Paladin, that's pretty much like, what I... He was like losing, like five minutes into the game. That did not stop him from talking trash the whole time. <laughs> that's why he's banned. <laughs> he's not, though. He is. He, he was playing. When? Like... Four days ago. Huh. Things can change in four days. Oh, Another so he's mentioned. banned now? Yep. That's... Ah, okay. Anyway, nice we kill, kill a here. Gruntier. Level two for the Keeper. And behind that, we have an expansion coming. Where's the Lodge? No Spirit Lodge yet. That AP there might is. go to town. It's going to be hard to deal with. No Wormel yet, which means uh, no Demolisher for a long time here. Damn, Robinson. AL always looking good for Night Elf recently. He built that AP so far away. <laughs> did a long walk. And now we can conquer him. That's really nice so far. The town is under siege. Wow, shop gone. Has to rebuild it. Lodge not up. Shadow Hunter only now joining. And the AP right in his face. Yeah, on AL, looking outside the main, there's so many spots to put an Ancient Protector, right? Could put it to the left, could put it to the little tiny green, over towards the orange. So many hidey holes. In the meantime, T2 almost done. Cooper apparently doesn't care too much about this AP. Yeah, losing the Ultra doesn't really matter too much, but once the Burrows get attacked, it's gonna be a little more sketchy. Here comes the Alchemist. Looking fresh. Oh, wait, did he not eat trees? Oh, he's not regening right now. Kind of weird. Okay, again, the AP dealt with kind of easily. Yeah, he did around 280 damage to an Alta, which <coughs> doesn't do much. But again, just buying time. Oh. There was time for the tier 2 to catch up, for the Keeper to finally creep a bit. A player's forces are under attack. All right, Shadow Hunter does yeah, Gonna get level two here. Now, the acid bomb is still pretty dangerous here early on. And losing that shaman would be painful for the Cooperino. Needs to be quick with a dispel. Yeah, nicely done. Perfect yeah. right away. Good multitasking as well as he's canceling the Entangled Gold Mine, canceling an Engine of War. He's getting a lot done with his Blade Master, and nothing would suit a Cooper play better than this. He's really good with the Blade. Still oftentimes plays Blade against Human, unlike almost all other Orcs. <sighs> Where did this one qualifying game, maybe a year ago or something, remember when Cooper was playing against Todd? Do you remember that tournament? No. I think it was Dreamhack or something else. It may have been worth three champions. Oh, and we're gonna have a creep jack here. Robinson not getting distracted by the blade anymore. That's pretty scary. Speed scroll. Oh, getting dispelled by the Cobalt Geomancer. <laughs> That's bad. Whoopsie. Okay, now we have a very hurt shaman in the bag. Get some damage out. We this time we will see a couple of more serpent wards. Uh oh, we're going for the shadow hunter. Might be able to find out. Sweet close of that surround by Robinson, who's really showing good skills here. Losing a couple of units, but again a hero kill, and this time on the more important one. Yeah, that double shadow that the shadow hunter wants to keep on creeping here. Oh, possible surround on the keeper. Oh, that was close. 
Ah, easy step. And this time he gets the expo up. Relatively easy. And Cooper, losing a hero, expands. Shadowhunter's gonna be back somewhat soon, but he's still missing quite a bit for that level press. Blade gonna get level three here. Oh yeah, he went for Windwalk. I feel like that's not the ideal build anymore. Windwalk level two, that is. But uh, I guess he likes roaming around with the blade, who's got another ring of protection. And Rob is deciding to look a little underleveled here. A player's forces are under attack. Yeah, level three keeper would be good. Just as good as being a back to Warcraft sub, like Mr. or Mrs. Emerald. 20 months already. Great job with WGL, guys. Thank you so much. Best Pokemon version there ever is and ever was. It was a lot of fun. A great tournament. Play trying to steal some assets here. Oh, there's a lot up for grabs. Oh, he doesn't quite get it. Didn't get the item either. Oh, getting entangled. Acid bombed. Would love to revert the patch 1.29 before that alchemist could also heal enemy units. Has to go for the end. Very nicely used there. Quick gets out of the entangle. But the keeper alchemist combo still has plenty of mana to use. More upgrades coming in. This expansion has been mining for a long time. Orc Expo. Still not up yet. It just takes so damn long. There's two towers here about to be up, but no reinforced D. Do you have reinforced D, Remo? I take vitamin D pills. I hope that helps. <laughs> Hopefully. Here we go. Pushing the expansion. Oh, is, uh, that, is that gonna work out though? I don't know. It's uh, expensive. Um, no uh, I don't know, Kev. Oy, 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 oy. Alchemist kind of has to do it alone. TP's oh, out. How well is this calculated? Oh, get it. Oh. oh, that feels real bad, man. Oh, that triggered a little. GG. Oh, man, it was such a decent game until then. Okay, a little bit of a gift. My man, Robinson, it was super cool to see you play. I had so much fun with you in the open qualifier. And you showed good games, man. Good blogs. Hope you keep grinding. I want more Robinson in my Warcraft life. Yeah, boy. Like colorful, you know. Keep at it. Keep playing. Keep getting better. And one day... You're gonna get the trophy. Maybe. Maybe not. Who, who knows? But yeah. Good to see you play here. That's a fast day here so far. We have three best of threes already done in 40 minutes. Only one lagging behind is uh, Biko and Hank. Exactly. And that might mean that we can catch the Starbuck game later, which would be pretty pog for us and our audience. So let me refresh this grid real quick. The Liquipedia keeps logging me out. I don't know a fix for this at all. Okay, just to bring you up to speed, Starbuck waiting for his opponent as we said, Biko and Hank still playing, Paladin defeats and eliminates Death Note with 2-0, is now up against Dice in an Night of Mirror, and Terra defeats Darkness and Undead Mirror, plus he's also up 1-0 against the Great Wall and might make it into WGL if he wins one more. Our next game is Germany versus Russia, it's Night Elf versus Undead round two in Kevin versus Cooper. So Kevin, get out of that chat. Warm up a little, pick and ban, and good luck. We are right back with that game and the decision after a little break.